All right, guys, so I want to apologize for this video getting up a little late. Um, this hunt actually took place back in 2014 out in eastern Colorado. We've been hunting this particular piece of property now for about seven years, and it has always been good to us. Um, so opening morning of antelope season, we get out to the property right about sunrise, and we notice right away that there's a good group of antelope right in the middle of the property. So I get out the spotting scope, and I determine that there's a good buck in this group um, that we want to check out and get a better look at. So we grab our gear and we start to put a stock on him. We got Jordan with the rifle and I'm behind the camera. Let's check it out. Yeah. Yeah, he's slowing down. He's limping. Yeah, you shot him. Yep, he's gonna go down. Nice. <laughs> nice. Good shot. Good shot. <laughs> shot. <laughs> Good job. That was awesome. Yeah, you see, just be patient with these animals. They don't come to you. He, he closed probably a couple hundred yards for us. I know. Nice shot. Oh man, he's an old fighter. Yeah, splitting that. See, that's a big buck. Is it a little puncture? Oh, man. He's a brawler. He's a big old puncture. Well, we're out here in eastern Colorado again this year uh, for annual antelope hunt. Uh, we did our normal thing. We drove around the, the perimeter of the property just checking things out. Um, didn't see a whole lot of activity this morning. We uh, got up on a high point here on the property and spotted this group of antelope out here. Um, this buck, uh, another small buck and a handful of does were out here and Spencer put the spot and scope on them and looked like a decent buck through the spot and scope so we came up with our game plan and snuck up on them. Got about, uh, when we first got on them they were about 350 yards out. Um, we just sat there and were patient on them and eventually right now in the middle of the rut the buck's just chasing the does around and eventually they worked our way back towards us. And, it was about 200 yard shot and uh, couldn't be happier with this buck. And it's a good older buck. Um, got a little bit of a fighting wound right here on his nose. Um, looks like it broke the bone and everything right there. And lots of character. He tells the fighter he's got splits there. Just a ton of character on this buck. All kinds of little knobs coming off of him. And, um, just couldn't be happier with the hunt. I mean, we get it done the first morning and now we get to have some fun.